Hi guys, I am starting the new build series. Today I will show you all the components you need. For the frame I bought Lentian Hex 4 to 15. Arms have 4 mm carbon. Overall weight is 115 grams. This is blue paint marker for the carbon parts. I will paint all the edges of this frame. For the motors, I bought Racer Stars. This packet has 4 longer and 4 shorter screws. They are very cheap for the quality they have. I bought each for $8. This 22 of 5 motors have 2600 kV. For the ESCs I also bought Racer Stars. Of course, with Bill Haley S firmware. These Racer Stars ESCs from MS series are 25 amps with a burst of 35 amps. Also, you get this manual with some throttle calibration instructions and default settings. They are quite tiny, one EC weighs 7 grams. For the propellers, I choose this Deuce 5040 triples. One prop only weights 3.2 grams. For the FPV camera, I choose Runcam Swift. Here in the box, you get camera with protection cap. different mounts and different cables also with OSD controller. For the VTX I bought Immersion RC Tramp HV transmitter. Main feature of this transmitter is the NFC module. This module you can connect to the transmitter and change signal strength and frequency wireless with the special wand. Also you get double tape, some wires, and stickers. For the PDB I choose Hub OSD. Of course, with integrated OSD. It handles from 3 to 5S. 
has two bags with 5 volts and 12 volts and also current sensor. This is SP Racing F3 Acro flight controller. Just a standard flight controller nowadays. Also, I bought Aumway antenna. And Lantian buzzer. For the radio, I bought Radiolink 89. With R9DS receiver. This receiver has telemetry port and also could be connected to the flight controller via PPM, PVM, or S bus. Quite cheap radio system for its quality. Also, I bought protection pack for my LiPo batteries. This is 4S LiPo battery with discharge rate of 75C with 1.3 Ampere hours. Also, I bought Fatshark Teleporter V5 for the FPV goggles. I get a bunch of wires, Fat Shark antenna and goggles with battery. On the top are placed volumes and channels up and down buttons and also head tracker button. On the right side are power and video in and out ports. Here you can see tracker port, switch for turning on and off the receiver and port for headphones. Also, you get 2S LiPo battery with capacity of 1 amp hours. This was the first part of the build. Subscribe, like and wait for the new awesome content.